I never said you were my enemy. You didn't have to say it. I'm sure you've heard the expression, actions speak louder than words. And yours were deafening. But ultimately they failed. I'm still here. And you don't have to like me, Spencer. But you do have to hear me when I say that this is over. There will be no more attacks. There will be no more scare tactics. Never again. It's not like anyone got hurt. I was trying to teach you a lesson. It's not like anybody got hurt. You don't think being separated from my child hurt? You don't think planning to leave her behind hurt? You fired the first shot. When you refused to testify against Valentine, you chose your face over my father. Ask me disgust that was wrong, but it does not give you the right to terrorize me. I'm sorry I took it this far, okay? Yeah, I'm not. But I am not sorry that I went after you. And we're back. You're bad for my father, Ava. And that's just a fact. Your father disagrees with you. I am his wife. And I'm not going anywhere. And if you ever come after me or my daughter again, there will be hell to pay. The hell unlike anything you have ever witnessed. You got me? You said it yourself. You've known Spencer since forever. Yeah. Is it possible that you want to push the blame on Esme because you don't want to blame a friend? Hmm. Possible, but highly doubtful. I'll see you later. Count on it. You're really lucky to have Cameron. He's an amazing guy. Yeah, he is. Esme, what do you want? I want Spence to be happy. That's it. That's it. And to be happy, he needs his friends. Cameron seems ready to put all this behind us. I'm hoping you can do the same. I already told you that I'm not giving up on Spencer. Just on me. Look. I may not be your favorite person, but Spence and I are a package deal. Cameron accepts that. You'd be wise to do that too. What is that supposed to mean? Just that I'd hate for you to be left behind. Hi, Trina. Mm -hmm. What was that? Nothing good. I'm not intimidated by you, Ava. And I will not let you poison my father against me. Your father's relationship with you is up to him. As for me, Nicholas knows that I will deal with you directly. And how are you going to do that? Mrs. Cassidyne, your housekeeper, Littleson. Excuse me, what are you guys doing? You can't just waltz in here. I called them. You called the police to have me thrown out? Oh, no, don't be silly. I called the police to have you arrested. What? Harassment, criminal mischief, breaking and entering. Well, you're about to face the consequences of what you've done. <laughs>